How you styling? Tyler Perry, baby. Why did I get married too? <laughs> so what was your guys' favorite part? All right. G-O, the number two, A-E-L-L. -L. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to the Hot Secret Salon Show. Today is Tyler Perry, Why Did I Get Married to review. And I took my cousins to the movie. And you might be saying they're too young to be watching grown um, situations, but the earlier they know about marriage and divorce, maybe they won't get married and divorced. Um, so take a look, and I hope you enjoy the review. I personally want to say thumbs up to Tyler. I've actually watched you um, live for Medea Goes to Jail, and I enjoy your plays, and I actually enjoy the movie. Um, I, th I learned a lot from it, and I actually saw my character. <laughs> the crazy girl <laughs> I'm not crazy I don't think Angie's crazy I think she just speaks her mind and sometimes you have to put certain things in check but anyhow she got out of character sometimes but I liked her and that's probably my best part but I do say Tyler you're doing a great job I like that you showcase black people in a different light you showcase us um, positive rich successful and having drama like everybody else it doesn't matter if you're rich or poor you're gonna have drama in your life it's how you deal with it, okay? So it's the choices you make and sticking through the choices. So how you style in Tyler Perry too? Take a look. Welcome to the Hot Secret Show. I'm on the road at the movie theater. Cause you know I had to check out the Tyler Perry and no, don't look at my wig because it needs to be done. I actually pulled out my hair and my wig can't fit. Yeah. <laughs> if it looks like it's halfway back, it's because it is. Anyhow. So I'm here with one of the, I don't think young people should, little kids should be seeing Tyler Perry, but I guess he makes it where kids can watch. It's not so bad, you know? So I'm Angie, the crazy one! So what's, what's your take on the Tyler Perry movie? What scene was your best? And can you react? Yeah, my favorite scene was when she went, um, the girl Angie, she went to, um, her husband's workplace, and she went on a rampage. She's like, "Who oh, are you with, Tyler? Nah, 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 nah. I know yeah. you're cheating on me. Why are you cheating on me? Nah, 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 nah. It was funny. Yeah. And then yeah. it turned out that I yeah. won't spoil the phrase, but she was overreacting. Yeah. 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 So that was your favorite spot. Yeah. So what? What would you start with? This? I would give this about three stars. Because I believe, why did I get married? The first one was better than this one. I actually disagree. I think there was more context. I think there was more storyline. It was longer. And I think this one was better, actually. I think they wrapped it up. Last time, I, they left me hanging. Like, I didn't understand. Like, okay, what was I supposed to learn? This one, I think, it still left me hanging. But I guess he wants to keep doing it. Yeah, she did, right? Yeah. Well, thank you. Yeah. So, we're over here. What's your take on the whole situation? What did you like? What was your best scene? Um, my favorite scene is when they were at the beach and she just came out of the water uh -huh. and the ashes <laughs> flew with the wind and I went all over her face and her body and she ran into the ocean and for a good 10 minutes she was trying to wash she, off she that She thought water. that was like sand. Obia. If you don't know what Obia is, a dead person's ashes. She thought the people were working something on her. It didn't work because she's still crazy. So, <laughs> so what's your take? Well, I think it was funny. The funniest part is when that Paddy got crazy, stopped mashing up stuff, breaking everything, and she's losing her mind. So what? What did you think that character fits her? Because I think last episode I thought Janet. Janet, but I didn't think her character came alive. But they really, really showed her in this one. So you like that? Yeah, she put more energy in this. What would you rate this event? This, this, this part four. Yeah, it was better than the first one. There's more action. Do you see? Do you learn anything? Even though you're not married, you're yeah. far from it. Yeah. Did you think married people would learn something from this? Or? Yeah. Yeah. More to put more trust in each other and stop doubting each other than doubting each other and then find out that you were there were overreacting. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. That's how we're styling, trying to stay married. If for those who are married. What's up? What's up? Oh, because I know I need some bacon jokes. <laughs> so hot secrets not. I shouldn't be taking kids to Tyler Perry, but they helped me clean up my house. And I promised to take them to the movie. <laughs> and I had to. But I, some of the scenes I thought was too explicit for them. But kids are watching more than that on TV anyhow. So 
You know what? What's your take on it? Sorry? Yeah, what's your whole take on the movie? Did you enjoy it? In the movie, the guy who she got to move by ex-wife. Okay. okay. And you, don't, you, don't like, you don't think no. man should abuse women? Yeah. Okay, but it happens every day. But I mean, in Tyler Perry, he has to spice it up and show that people do get angry. People do overreact. Yeah. That's what you Get our calipari on. Okay. This is this is scarf lady. <laughs> I like lady. <laughs> Actually, listen. Not only do I meet celebrities on the hot secret show, I meet them outside. Guess who she looks like? <laughs> okay. We always have something to say. What, what's your take on the, the whole kind of thing? Do you think that this is too mature for kids? Like, did you feel like it was too much for you to be in the movie watching it? Or? Not really. It was actually did you learn anything? I learned, um... Choose your man right. Yeah, choose your man right. Don't you? <laughs> no, there's no right man out there. You have, you have to invest. You have to trust, you have to work together, and you have to forgive, okay? And then you'll probably have somewhat of a perfect marriage. There's no perfect Maybe. marriage. All right, is there any perfect, you think there's any perfect marriages out there? Not really. So that's how we're styling. We're catching up with people, getting their feedback on the Tyler Perry. Why did I get married for two? And I think there'll be three, four, and five, because black people are always gonna have drama in their lives. <laughs> people's lives so I think I think as a as people who have friendships and they do things in group they should actually try to find which character fit the, their um, their relationship because I think in each person that was in the movie it actually showed somebody's character maybe your friend maybe you that's how I'm styling I don't know you know who I am <laughs> Is that her name? I think so yeah, I'm the crazy girl okay how are you styling I know earlier I said I was Angie, but I, from my hairstyle, I think I'm Janet. What do you guys think? Janet? If you want a twin, call me. <laughs> Tyler, if Janet don't want to do the next episode, <laughs> call me. <laughs> I'm just joking. Here we have another young person that saw Tyler Perry, Why Did I Get Married? Two, baby! So what's your best part, or what would you like to say about this? What do you rate the movie, first of all? Um, I'll rate the movie probably a four out of five. Um, I thought it was it was really good. It was longer. It's about two hours, so it kept me going. And there's a lot of surprising things in it. Yeah. Like, like each moment was just something, something, something. to come. Okay. Yeah. So. And did you like that it was like all black cast? Like, did you like that? I did. Right. I did like it. Yeah. Tyler, I know you're. What do you call um when it's for kids? PG. PG I know yeah, you like yeah. to do PG, but could you show a little bit more sexiness of black people, man? The body.